And for the past nine months, we've been working with the community in Island Key to come up with an idea that brings a community spirit into Island Key. Um, and it started off with a consultation right here with three flip charts. And the three flip charts asked three simple questions. Mainly, what would you like in your community? Uh, NAPCO came down and we had a meeting. There was only maybe six or seven of us at the meeting, but um, we really got into it. The ones of us that were there um, got into the whole idea of and it. It really ended up with a, a conversation to put paint on walls. Myself and the housing officer, Dara Sheehy, um, sourced six street artists from Dublin and the members then selected which they preferred. And Shane Sutton, the artist that has been painting on the wall now for the past two days, was the artist that was chosen. We've also had a number of consultations after that decision-making process with Shane. Um, sitting down with the members, Shane coming up or helping the members come up with ideas of what could happen on the wall from a landscape of deers in a forest to what is going to be coming up, which is a, a spaceman with Pac-Man and the feel of the 80s, but in the, the 21st century. We tied with the idea of like a football photograph or, or sorry, painting, and um, but then the painter himself came up with this idea of doing um, paintings on the wall that the kids can interact with their phones by going, taking pictures and going on Instagram. I don't know if I'm explaining that right. I'm not very with it when it comes to technology, but I'm dying to have a go myself. Ha, ha, ha. 